the industry doesn't give you more time, doesn't give you more money, yeah, doesn't give you more resources. So you have to be creative with what you have. And that can be, again, another, I know there's professionals who think exactly the opposite, that the less resources you have, the more creative you are. I do tend to think that's probably just, a, it becomes very incestuous relationship with your materials and your, it's like, it's only that much you can do. And it all looks the same at the end, um, which we see now <laughs> in the area of knitting technologies. The products look very much one like another because there is not much looking outside that field and the technology itself. The technologies are so complicated to learn and people spend so much time doing that, only that. And then there is nothing from outside. There is no going out and in, out and in. So then it just becomes repetitive, I think. Did I answer your question? Yeah, I had a, yes, yes, that, that was fabulous. That, and that makes sense. I, I do want to also zone in on your mention of the interdisciplinary classroom and having students from so many different majors. How does that impact the culture of your studio space that the students are working in? I bet it's fabulous. Uh, 